Hello. If you're watching this video, then you're probably enrolled in or thinking of enrolling in a course I am teaching. Here's a little more about me. I was born in Wales and grew up in the United Kingdom, mostly in Manchester, in the north of England, supporting United rather than City, but not very passionately. My one slight claim to sporting fame is that I was in the same class as Michael Atherton, future England cricket captain, and once bowled him out in a playground game of cricket. I did my undergraduate degree in English at Cambridge University, but not before spending almost a year in Central America, mostly Nicaragua and El Salvador, where I first started to learn Spanish and become interested in the history, politics and culture of Latin America. A couple of years later, I returned for another nine months, this time above all to Guatemala and El Salvador. It was a fascinating time to be in Central America, with a revolutionary regime in Nicaragua, a civil war in Salvador, and widespread social protests and state repression in Guatemala. After finishing my BA, I moved to the United States, where I did an MA in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, and a PhD at Duke University in North Carolina. It was during my PhD that I first connected my personal interest in Latin America with academic study of the region. I then taught in Spanish departments back in the UK, in Scotland and England, before coming to Vancouver and UBC, where I've been for almost 20 years. I now live in East Vancouver with my wife and 11-year-old son, David. David likes sailing, playing the guitar and snowboarding. I ski more or less badly alongside him and sometimes take him to concerts. He has an older sister who lives in Montreal after graduating from McGill and a brother who started at UBC but is now working in restaurants downtown. My research is on the relationship between literature, culture and politics. But I have broad interests and teach a diverse range of topics from Spanish language to narco novels colonial Latin American literature to romance studies. I bring energy and enthusiasm and perhaps a bit of British humour to the classroom. I try to teach students both how to do close readings of texts, thinking carefully about the words in front of them, and also how to address bigger theoretical questions, reflecting on what the material says to and about them and us all. In general, I prefer questions to answers, problems to solutions, and hope that none of my courses are the last word on anything, but that they keep you thinking long after the semester is over. I'm also keen on using technology, blogs, videos, open websites, and experimental pedagogy, contract grading, flexible syllabuses, both to enhance student choice and freedom and to stress the connections between what we do at university and what happens in the rest of the world. I know that university can be stressful. Classes can be intimidating and your future uncertain. These are not easy times. But I think it can also be exciting and even fun. I hope to do my bit to reduce any anxieties you may have and help you learn to feel more confident even outside your comfort zone. If you have any issues with the course, with the university in general, or with anything else, it is always better to talk to me about them rather than hide and hope they'll go away. My job is to help you pass and even do well, and there are almost always things that can be done to alleviate any pressure. I'm interested in your saying what you think and thinking about what you are saying. I aim to help you grow into the person you want to be, critical and thoughtful about the world around you and your place in it. See you in class.